Yeah, there's a package here. That's a big package. <laughs> I like it. Uh, it is me, the Lurker. You've changed your name. What's going on here? It's Cool Arrow. Oh, I see. I get it. I get it now. Cool Arrow. You, you, you've got to stop confusing me like that. Time just got has got away with me. EB, how you doing, baby? And I sleep naked uh, to give it my full attention. So yeah, we'll get on with this unboxing soon. Uh, is the lamb here yet? Mm -mm, Leo is here. And Doctor Nerd is he there? Uh, why don't I see Doctor Nerd's name? How strange. Oh, there he is. Lamb's here. Right, we can get on then. If Lamb's here, we can get on. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, then welcome to the channel. This is part one in the series of the traveling guitar. The guitar in question is the Harley Benton double cut kit. Um, you can see this was the unboxing live on stream. You can see that on my channel. And I also did a review of it, built it and stuff. And you can see a video of that now. Um, so the idea behind this is that um, this has been sent to one of my Hutch Clubbers, subscribers if you like. Um, they are going to do a mod to it. Then they're going to send it on to another subscriber and they're going to do a mod to it. And they're going to send it on to another subscriber and so on and so on. You get the idea. Until eventually it comes back to me. Now I don't know what anybody's doing to it. I know the people that are involved. There's about five or six people involved at the moment. It may grow. We don't know yet. Um, as time goes on. Um, so they have complete freedom to what they do to it as long as they don't uh, destroy the other person's work. Um, so it's gone off to the Netherlands to uh, Dirk the Lurker, a.k.a. the Dungeon Master, a.k.a. Cool Arrow, a.k.a. Dirky Lurky. Um, and he's going to be doing something to it. And in this video, you can see him receiving it, unboxing it. Uh, and some clips of that video and you can see the full video on his channel so please go over there subscribe to him and watch that as well it is quite funny like an idiot I lost the footage of me uh, packing the guitar up and I made a nice little pretty book with pretty letters on and got my arts and crafts going and uh, because I'm stupid I lost the footage I've been saying it for years you are stupid Brent <laughs> no you're stupid no you're stupid no you're stupid, stupid. you're stupid, no, you're stupid. Uh, uh you're stupid Stupid. Anyway, it has arrived safe and sound in the Netherlands, uh, so that's all good news. Um, I'm going to leave you with a little bit of a demo of the guitar as it was when I built it without any modifications whatsoever, and then we're going to take you over to, uh, to Dirk for a little bit of unboxing from him. Stupid. The actual idea is it's uh, part of a series called The Travelling Guitar. 
and it's going to travel from me to the next one who is also going to do some crazy mod and then it's going to be sent off to the next person who can do a crazy mod and so on and so on until it gets back to its rightful owner which is Brett H Brent Hutchinson um, uh, from the YouTube channel with the same name and he's going to unveil it in what we call the Hutch Club which is actually a really nice place on YouTube to chill and meet new people um, so uh, let me show you what happened this morning uh, when I received the package I was just kidding. You just fucking left. <laughs> Did you just fucking left? It's just this, this guy just. I'm still in my PJs, but this guy just came up, uh, brought the package, put it right in front of the door, and you just drove off. Really, Brent, Mister Lurker. For real? <laughs> I like it. I love it. <laughs> package here, package here, package here. That's a big package. It was just a bit weird because the DHL guy was, well, uh, here's a package. I'm back. But this is a big package. I wasn't expecting that big of a package. But um, big packages need little knives to open it. Where the hell will I begin? He's got a knife. <laughs> He's got a knife. That's a knife. Let's do this on video so you can see my fuck ups. something from Tolman in there. Apparently you excel in crafts as well. <laughs> Here's this book. No oh, wait, wait, there's a text in here. Let me read this. Thank you for thanks for being part of this project. Please use this book to explain your contribution to the guitar and to leave any messages for your fellow Hutch Clubbers. Don't forget to video your work for the YouTube series. Uh, also feel free to make your own video for your channel. PTO. My contribution is the guitar itself as a blank for you guys to work on. The first person is going, uh, it is going to, it, it's going to, okay, it, okay. <laughs> uh, to Dirk. A.K.A. the Lurker, A.K.A. the Dungeon Master, lol. <laughs> yeah, well, you have no idea what impact you had with that, so just stay tuned. In the Netherlands, I hope it has will arrive safely. Good luck and have fun. Be a Hutch. Very cool. Um, yes, I will document it. Yes, I will make a video of it. I'm going to make some changes to this too. Because I, I do like this though. I do like this, but, 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 oh, um, uh, yeah. You know me. I like to build stuff and create stuff and destroy stuff. All in the process. What's this? 
Um, I know what this is. I'll, I'll do that later. <laughs> Ta -ta. Pick this. Let me see, what are we going to work with for the next few weeks? Probably <laughs> hard. What is going to <laughs> do anything to it because this is actually quite smooth. I wasn't expecting that. It's nice. Reasonably chunky. I like chunky. It's not big. It's a bit flat for my taste, but it feels nice. It feels good. Huh. Put this over here. I'm still open that camera up there and there is still working properly. Still working? This is the body. This is actually right, nice. I like the white carve on it. That's pretty cool. It's actually a lot closer to an SG. I actually thought it was, I thought it would be more like a Viper, but they made some changes to the bottom. Because, as you can see, this is uh, very much the same. I mean, it's really close. It's just the, um, the one horn that's a bit higher, I guess. Can we do that? On my knee. Yeah, it's just the, the the larger horn is a bit longer, but mostly it's pretty much spot on. It's not. And that's good because this will make my plans for it a lot easier. It's a two piece body, I guess. One piece. I love how they just do it. A bit diagonally, I guess. Can you see that? But overall, it looks good. Nice cavities. I mean, they've got a few uh, weird spots in there, but yeah, that's okay. You're not going to see that anyway. How's this fit in there? Let me see. Oh, that is that is snug. Very nice. Did they trim the edge to be there? Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. This is actually not bad. What's in the... Uh, let me see. I just realized I get to do a Harley Benton unboxing for the for my own channel um, but I didn't actually order a happy Benty <laughs> it just got sent to me uh, oh yeah with the blah blahs and the blah blahs and the blah blahs this is actually three ply I said you were it was, I thought you said it was one but it's actually three ply it's got this white layer in it that's not bad swings we're gonna reuse those cables I've ever seen. As expected with the um, plug and just it's a quick plug-in system. It's solderless so you just you can just put it together and that will be the end of it. Um, very nice. Actually it's a lot better quality than I expected it to be. I'm not usually a big fan of cheap stuff, but this actually feels good. The pots feel it a bit heavy even. 
they're gonna feel really really nice so that's some parts oh yeah the pickups there's nothing on the back I'm guessing these are Roswell's I do like how they put the extra solder in sometimes uh, that isn't the case looks like they're is that wax? Is it really? Oh wow, they're really waxed. That's pretty cool. And of course, I've got two of those. Oh, here's the plate with the travel and the rhythm section. Ah, this is what I was looking for. Because I haven't seen. I'm guessing these are for the Hutch Club guitar. These are actually not bad. I mean, the bridge, it's a bit... Um, why isn't this flat? But it's not bad. It's reasonable quality. Feels good. Oh, there's a little bit of movement in here. Maybe the screw is an old lady. I even started mumbling. I have to put the uh, mic closer to me. Um, but yeah, it looks pretty good, to be honest. So, basically, because we've all seen it completed. But it's actually a pretty decent fit. But yeah, I do like the body. It's really smooth. It kind of looks good. It's, it's a nice grain in there. I mean, it's, it's not premium or anything but it's it's actually really nice you've even got some lighting on it I mean it's very well sealed yeah you can see when you look in there let me take this you can actually see when you look inside the cavities um, uh, yeah, well, they are a bit um, rough. And so is the drilling. It's not, not exactly spot on. I got me the hiccups. Yeah, you can see that this side is a lot higher than on a normal SG. They're almost next to each other. But other than that, it actually looks like an SG. It's not that far off. So that's going to make my idea for the guitar a lot easier. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be, it's going to be really interesting to see um, what this is going to do. And I just realized I've been really unprofessionally filming this. But hey, it's the Dungeon Master. So what you're going to do. So that is part one of the travelling guitar. That was Dirk the Lurker, aka the Dungeon Master, aka Cool Arrow, aka Dirky Lurky. Uh, please go and subscribe to his channel and subscribe to this channel too if you like this kind of thing and you can keep up to date with how the guitar is going. I'm really excited to see what happens and how it evolves over the coming however long it's going to take. Um, so there's only one more thing left to say right now and that is peace. Till next time. You gonna cue the jingle or what? That's a big package. One, two, three, four. If you like my YouTube show, hit like and comment and get involved. If you dig my vibe, then hit subscribe and never miss an episode of my YouTube show. Till next time.